Hi, welcome to Gunnerman Adventures. I'm Jason. I'm Alex. And today we're going to do some metal detecting on an old railroad bed again. A different one this time. So we found an old uh, railroad bed and hopefully a logging camp on one of the old maps that we've seen online. So we're going to go metal detect this, see if we can't find something. Uh, hopefully some more railroad spikes and that elusive, elusive axe head. So thanks for watching and wish us luck. So on our walk in, we found our first find on the main trail. Show them. It's a... 22 long. Nice. Well, we found a metal bar. They'll load us down, but uh, it's something. Looks like we are on the right track because we found the uh, railroad spike. Did you get the pun? We're on the right track. All right, continuing on. Well, this is our next find. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Yeah, so. Uh, a couple of railroad, uh, railroad spike. With a hole in it. And a couple in this bar thingy. Solid metal. It's pretty heavy. I don't know. Do you guys know what this is? No? I think there's supposed to be another hole right here, but it looks like it's welded in. But all right. Awesome. Well, we didn't have to go too far, and then we found this little tiny railroad spike. I don't think I've ever seen one that small, but... I don't know what the purpose was, but we'll have to research that up a little bit. All right. Awesome. So we found this real heavy piece, almost 12 inches long. It's got holes in it too, so I don't know what that was for either. But it broke off on the end. I think I know. I think that's for like the knots to hammer in. No, I don't think so, but it's just, it could be. You could be right. What do I know? But it's a heavy piece. So, all right. Good find so far. There is so many ruts in here. It's so hard to dig. Well, we got a strong hit on this. So let's see what we get. Looks to be another railroad spike head. That's cool. Missing the rest of it. All right, awesome. So I found a little knot to the um, railroad track. Railroad spike. Railroad Top. Spike. Well, you won't believe it. We found another piece of metal. Uh, from the railroad track and as you can see it had grown into the end of the tree so there you go crazy so this is another railroad spike again I found the spike and I on the top of the spike. Well, 
So we were finding so many iron objects, uh, we decided to switch over to uh, where it discriminates against the, the ferrous stuff. So trying to find something, we got a huge hit. And what did we find? A little old Milwaukee shorty. I don't know what it's doing way out here in the middle of nowhere, but well, the guy's got a thirst. The guy's got a thirst, right? Yeah. All right. All right, continue on. Well, we found a lot of railroad artifacts out here today. Hey, boy. So we're gonna call it because, well, it's all iron and it weighs a ton. And so we'll get when we get back to the Jeep, we'll, we'll show you what we got. Okay. All right, everybody. Well, we're walking out. We're on a trail. The closest house is like five miles away. As you can see, there is nothing on this back back road that's you can't even drive on it because they dug out the ends. And for some reason, we keep hearing something behind us, and there was a clanking of metal, and then nothing. So, if we don't make it back and you find this, you, you know what happened. Somebody's spying on us. We want our treasure. Mm. Well, we didn't get eaten by Bigfoot. That was weird, though. But, uh... We found a lot of great stuff today, as you can see here. So we found railroad spikes. We found these bars here that we're not quite sure what they are. Uh, we found some, the old Milwaukee shorty can. And uh, what else we got there? We found the, the 22 shells here. We found two of those, those are on the walk-in. And then uh, pieces of railroad spikes. So overall, it was a good day. We found a lot of stuff. We didn't walk very far. Um, so we'll definitely be coming back out here again. And uh, I want to show you a picture of something. If you can identify it, we will give you a free Gunnerman journal. If they can identify this next picture. If you want to enter, make sure you put the answer in as well as uh, like and subscribe. So if you like, subscribe and answer correctly, you could win and then we'll contact you. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone. We appreciate it. Make sure you click the links below. We do have a shop. Uh, so if you could click that and get yourself some sweet looking gear. No cowboy hats, unfortunately. And then uh, again, like and subscribe. Thank you so much.